Guys, today's the day. Today is the day we hit a quarter of a thousand episodes. It's a weird milestone, but I'm excited. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster. I Shinobi. We have episodes 249 and 250 of our One Piece watch for the day. And the last one, we got more backstory on who Tom actually was and how awesome he actually was. And just how much he actually did for Water 7. And I'm assuming everything went downhill. I'm not sure how much more we're going to see of just the, the past because we ended off with them finishing up the train and i'm I, i'm guessing from then on water seven started thriving we're gonna hop right into these if you're new to the channel drop us up and hit that big boy bell let's get started with the episodes it was it was like our tree house kind of I don't, I don't look at the name cutty flam my home where would he have hidden it not just like among the books and stuff oh that's surprising that he wouldn't want to give it up. I feel like Frankie would die before he says anything. Oh! Usopp, you cannot fight them, bro. Zoro and Luffy lost. A trump card. What is it? Huh? It's so ironic that Tom was sentenced for building Roger's ship when, like I said, in this day and age now, the government... Oh, shoot. Was he, like, publicly executed? In this day and age, the government works with pirates that are really strong, that are too strong for them to handle. Oh, my God. He fought them. But he fought the Navy? Eight years. Okay. And, they, yeah, it did start thriving. What a beautiful station. Oh, my gosh. So it took a little over a decade. There was a bit more time. Yeah, he brought Water 7 back to life. We saw how much they were struggling. The shipwrights were killing themselves. And it makes sense that they'd kind of be stingy on prices at first. They know they can afford to. And give it time. The economy has to slowly rebuild itself. God, Tom is such a beam of light. Is that Frankie? It's gonna. Oh, wait. It's, I think it's a cannonball. This isn't Frankie's cannon. CP5. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh! <laughs> My cannon salute. 35! Oh my god. Bro. Frankie's kind of cracked with it. <laughs> Still calls him Stupidberg. Why? They're awesome. Why? It's ironic because Iceberg originally wanted to destroy them, but Frankie ended up becoming the demolitionist. Mm. Yeah, but if it ends up in the wrong hands, it's kind of like what's going on now with Pluton. <laughs> <laughs> is there a, another investigative unit from the government? Oh. Huh? Wait, is this when they originally came for Pluton? The blueprints? They had found out about it? Just so you know, like, if he, if he had designed it by now. Or how long it existed. Ah, oh, it's for something else. Oh, they are there for that. So it came to push came to shove, so they used CP9, an un undercover one. Oh, so they're, they're who found out about him building Rod. Look at his face! I love Tom, bro! Yeah, he's, he's already been on trial. They are on Organized. Yeah, how does he not know? How is he so lacking information? I like how he just went and asked the bartender. Is it this guy's fault for what happened? Mm. Are these five the, the five elder stars? Mm. We get direct look at them like discussing the Pluton. 
These are the Elder Stars, right? I gotta look at my notes. One, two, three, four, five, and huh. I swear there was an old woman, though. Spandam's kind of the worst. Ooh. <laughs> Damn, this guy hella clunky. Oh, there it is. Is this when he entrusted it to him? He had to do it early if, if he knew the government was that on to him. Mm. Yeah, they found out about it. This long ago, man. Eight years. Gosh. I want to see! Worst monster ever. I called it a monster. Where did he get them? Let's try building it! Has <laughs> it got into the wrong hands? It was the same application from when Frankie was making ships. I really want to see it, man. It's up to them. Huh. Oh! Wait, he was... Tom was worried about Robin? And then passed on that worry to Iceberg? Why? Oh. He never wears pants. The perv uproar? They're they're in this like shack now or like this place outside now. Probably because he saved Water Seven. Now like the the, the city like accepts them and him and Tom. Trial day. Who can judge? Oh no. Yeah, because he's such a beloved person. It's quite grand. <laughs> okay, cool. He's got first-hand experience. Yeah. Nobody except one person. Wait, does he frame Tom? Wait, but there would be no reason for Tom to attack the ship. They're battle Frankies! Wait, why? Wait, is it all his ships? Who is manning them? Oh, man. It was all foreshadowing when Iceberg warned him about other people using them. Oh, man. CP5. It has to be. It's someone from every... It's one person in their group. There were like five of them, I think. And I think it's like five or six ships. It's one of each of them. But what reason would Frankie have to do that? Oh my god. I guess on the assumption that, like, if they hadn't said Tom was innocent, but yeah, Frankie would attack, just in case. It is him, isn't it? Yep. Sacrifice for justice. Shameless. God. Just because one guy had a problem with the fact that he built Roger's ship. Now they pull him away, get off, and then everybody just knows it's Frankie's ships. Wouldn't you incriminate yourself by running over? Yeah, because then all that's there is just the ships and you. Oh, man. They literally just need one person to interrogate and admit. all because of the weapon he had made damn how oh my god how much responsibility has frankie held himself for over the years for this they said they they're gonna say they launched a counterattack because frankie attacked the judicial ship they don't even need the people's approval but he ended up having to and this literally directly correlates now to them having the blueprints for the Pluton. And I would Im imagine that's that's how uh, Frankie is able to keep them so safe because, because he saw firsthand what a, what a dangerous ship can do. Or a couple built just by him. Not even to mention a, a blueprint by Tom where even Tom called it a monster. Even he said that like it, it's a dangerous creation. I just want to know what it looks like, man. For them just to be scared of the blueprints of it. Can you imagine if it's built? Episode 250, Let's run it a quarter of the way through a thousand. Where's your proof? Yeah, it just pens it. 
Like he just defeated them. Yeah. Why would he attack? Let's hear your reasoning. God, he just looks creepy, man. They're technically part of the same government, but just... This shows true corruption. Look at him! He wants the blueprints for himself. I don't know if he wants them for... The, well, I mean, I think he wants them for to show the Elder Stars, but... All I can say is splendid. The attack on me today? Not so splendid. It's null. But they don't have any proof, and they're gonna take Spandam's side over Frankie and them. <laughs> Government corrupt? Yeah! Why would he do that? That's so goofy. You silly people. You fools. I mean, it's, it's all side against them. There's not much you can say or do. Why? Does Tom just think that it's like a, a battle not worth fighting for? Like it's 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 sided against them. He might as well just die. Oh, he wants them to stand by what he made. God. He built Roger's ship. And Usopp didn't create going Mary, but he has that sort of connection with Mary. One that he can't give up. That's something I think Frankie hasn't seen for a while. Maybe talking with Usopp has kind of reminded him of all that. Oh, no. Yeah, it's a losing battle. Yeah. He's gonna try and hurt that guy as much as possible before he goes out. Damn. It's over. You might as well go out absolutely hurting this dude that hurt Frankie. Damn, man. I like how Tom recognized that, though. He knew. Oh, tranquilizers. Not actual bullets. Oh, that's why he's so strong, because he has a fish, man. Dude, it's not even remotely offset by the fact that he saved Water 7? Oh my god. He just hurt Spanda because Spanda hurt Frankie. If you leave Frankie and Iceberg alone and Kokoro alone... He will, but they won't. That Roger guy. He always was, though. He did what he, he had to do to save water zone. They gotta keep it going. That's what One Piece is, it's all about dreams. He fulfilled his. He's changing the- what? Oh yeah, he's just gonna- okay. He's gonna take what Tom said. They're taking Tom to any lobby. Not Frankie and Iceberg. So did they- did they execute him there? It's too late for him, but it's not too too late for them. It's all stacked. So are people in prison there or executed? I think they said that Tom was executed, but I don't remember. Don't do anything, Frankie. Don't. Oh my god. What a piece of trash. Oh no. <sighs> Damn! But he's undoing the good that Tom did and what Tom threw away for him. Face got bent! Yeah, how did how did Frankie get away with this? 
Did he just fake his death? Or? I mean, it was so long. It was eight years ago that I guess over time. I guess he did technically change his identity. Huh? What? Is that a cannon? Oh my god. Buddy wants Spandam's body. He's, he's the one the Joker hit me. Hit me. Come on. Well, he wouldn't want to destroy Puffing Tom, though. Yeah, it's, it's kind of it's sheer irony taking Tom to its, its, its imprisonment, his death. Dude, Puffing Tom looks indestructible. Oh! It does not have voice activation. <laughs> oh my god. He just pushed right past them. Tore into him. Dream ship. So does this correlate to how he eventually got like the, the things in his arms? Is it because the train hit him? I didn't even think about that. How the, the, the gap isn't filled. Speaking of, they all try to just forget about it. Oh, I'm strapped! True. Spit. おお、ウォーターセブンで海兵とその他役人に100人を超える重傷者を出した。あの、ハンガーを守る。あの、ハンガーを守る。あの、ハンガーを守る。あの、ハンガーを守る。あの、ハンガーを守る。あの、ハン